And Whitney and Ben, on, on behalf of all of us, thank you very much for inviting us to be a special part of your day. Your family and friends have made a, a commitment before you entered the room to make this a really special night for the two of you. Now, a few years later, when Ben came back from his family trip um, with his bum, he told me, hey, I picked up a girl. <laughs> and he told me about this girl that she lives in New Zealand. And at the time, I thought, man, how are you going to keep this long distance relationship? And that was also when I realized how wrong I was about Ben, because he was so protective and caring towards her. Um, so our mums saw firsthand how we met uh, over the following weeks. They could see how close we were getting along and her mum being overly protective and all asked my mum, hey, what your son doing? <laughs> <laughs> you know my daughter already has boyfriend. <laughs> when Whitney first shared how she and Ben met, I was like, damn girl, that's your destiny right there. And here we are now. Isn't it amazing how fate works? How they met on the other side of the world while living right next to each other, continent-wise, of course. It is still a beautiful love story that I share with my friends till this day. You are the sunrise waking my day. You are the moonlight shining my way. This is where I call home. You made the biggest sacrifice for me. To leave your friends, family and home in New Zealand behind. But I promise to make it up to you, giving you all my love, care and the life you deserve here in Australia. <laughs> I'll keep you very occupied with cooking, cleaning, washing. <laughs> my brand new handsome husband, I would have never thought that I'd be marrying a guy that I met on a Kentucky tour bus, seated across the aisle from me nine years ago across the globe in Europe. To some of you this may seem like kind of a love story that you see on the big screen, but for us it could only be fate that brought us together. This is where I call home. Take this woman to be your wife. He does. <laughs> I call upon the persons here present to witness that I, Ben, take you, Whitney, to be my lawful wedded wife. Now take this ring and don't lose it. <laughs> well, Whitney and Ben, everyone gathered here today so very happy. With that said, it really does give me great pleasure to use the power vested in me to declare you husband and wife.
once heard that marriage is not only about finding the right partner, but also about becoming one. And I couldn't agree more. Today is a day I will never forget. I love you, thank you for spoiling me, and I hope you continue to do so for the rest of our lives.